Okay, let's do another glitch video featuring a Jack and Daxter game. Jack 3. This glitch is exactly the same as the one that I showed you in Jack 2. And if I didn't mention that it doesn't work in the PS3 version, then I meant to mention it. And this one doesn't work in the PS3 version either. So, um, scene play act 1, intro movie. And again, I'm not going to show you the full movie. There are hardly any, any of it, really. So, uh, here's something I didn't mention before. You can actually pause the cutscenes in the Jack and Daxter games, and the square button uh, enables and disables subtitles. They are automatically enabled when you start up the cutscene if you haven't disabled them already. So let's do this. Exactly the same as in Jack 2. Just eject the disc, and as soon as you eject it, then press the triangle button to skip the cutscene, and then insert the disc, and it should work. Okay, we got this message like we did in Jack 2, the same message, except instead of saying Jack 3, it's Jack 2, it says Jack 3. So, insert the disc. Continue, and we end up in a very bad spawning place. Yep. That little dot down there is us, don't know if you can see it, but no, it's gone now, we must have died. But anyway, um, we can't move, and for some reason we can't die, so... Restart mission like we did in Jack 2, and we can move. Okay, well, what you want to do is, uh... Double jump as soon as you spawn, and do that to get over there, but, um... I failed, so yeah. come on. Oh, I'm terrible at this. Make it. <clears throat> You're killing me here, Jack. Yes, and that's why it's a PlayStation Hero. Okay, we are in the desert, which is huge. I mean, this is really huge. Oh, I wish we had the jet, the jet board or the hoverboard or whatever it's called. Yeah. So, uh, like in Jack Two, when we were in Sandover Village, the uh, water doesn't make a splash and, they c and we can't swim. And there's no lug shark, of course, in this game. There aren't any lug sharks anyway. No, there's some sort of squid thing that kill, kills you, but it's not here because this is a glitch. And of course, I'm not, I'm not going to show you all the way around the desert because that would take a really, really long time, and I've just realised I've got pickups. Oh, that doesn't interrupt my commentary. This is probably very boring for you. Actually, about half the people who watch this have already started watching the video because all they wanted to do was find out how to do the glitch. Okay. Alright, here's something I found out when I was playing Jack and Dax, so the Precursor Legacy Roots. Um, if you do this rolling move, then jump as soon as you land. You can jump really high. And this, this used to be an attack in the first game, but um, in Jack 2 they uh, just made it so that it's a faster way of getting around. Don't know what else to say. Yeah, there's not really much to do. We can't go anywhere. I think if we um, go over there, we'll just go straight through a wall. And I don't think there's any ground under there either. Let's try it. Yep, straight through it. 
Oh, this is ground. Okay. I use this ground. Oh, we can't go through there. Oh, we can go through there. Sorry if I can't make this very entertaining, but uh, the only entertaining part about this glitch is actually doing the glitch. This would be a lot more entertaining if I had the jet board and the glitch that makes the jet board go really fast if you use it in the desert. I don't know why I paused it. I just said, for absolutely no reason, probably because I'm bored. Because we have gone past the only entertaining part of the glitch. And of course, the green sun is there. And I never mentioned that in, uh, in, Jack, in Jack 2 video that I made, that Sandover Village glitch, I never mentioned that. Um, in the Jack in the Jack games, they have a green sun, and in a cutscene in this game, oh, it's behind clouds now. Oh, it's back again. In a cutscene in this game, um, a monk tells Jack and Daxter that that sun is going to destroy us all, and is it moving? It's moving. It's going up. Time must go by really fast in this game. I don't know why it's green, it just says, I like it green. And these camera controls are inverted. Oh, what's that? A purple sun. I didn't know there were other suns, I thought there was just green sun. There was always a green sun in the first game. Oh, it's behind the clouds. And it's back again. Um, what else can I say? If you play, if you play the first game, and then play this game, you'll see a huge improvement on the graphics. You watch it. Expect this game is by Naughty Dog. They all have good graphics. I think the first game was either from 2001 or 2002, and that has got great graphics for the time. And I'm just doing this rolling jump because there is nothing else for me to do. Um, Jack got a haircut. It's different now. Also, also in, uh, in Jack 1, uh, Jack was a mute, but well, he's not anymore. And this is, uh, I also let's play in this game and the first game and the second game. And uh, well, that animation where you do that kicking attack and that's uh, holds on to Jack's hair is still here. I could show you that again if he'll do it. There it is. Um, there's not really much else I can say about this. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Alright, that's it for this vid. See you in the next.